today we're gonna be building a mech with one of the weirdest materials I've ever used. Yes! I'm talking about that tree over there, okay? We're gonna be making a giant tree mech. <laughs> now, one thing that's actually gonna help a ton is that at some point, I actually made a spy tree because I'm a weirdo. <laughs> And yeah, this thing right here is actually a very accurate copy of one of the trees over there. I mean, as you can see, that thing actually looks really good. But uh, yeah, this thing currently, um, I mean, it's not an actual tree, okay? This thing is, is actually just, you know, like a weird spy device. So we're actually gonna have to turn this into a tree mech. But first off, let's actually make everything visible so we can see what we're actually building with. Okay, we gotta get rid of all of this stuff because this is not what we need anymore. All right, dude, now that is actually gonna make for a really cool leg. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna make sure that I have no more like, yeah, okay, I have no more parts that I can actually control inside of the tree right there because, you know, if I did, it would mess everything up. All right, now, you know what? I'm just gonna dupe this thing real quick because honestly, this is looking really good. Like, I didn't expect it to actually look this good. Now, it's got a lot of parts, so this thing might actually become very, very laggy. Actually, one thing I'll probably delete first is a little random bits and bobs at the bottom here because those add a lot of lag. Yeah, I'm, I'm already gonna get rid of them, dude. There's no chance that this thing is not gonna crash if I don't get rid of these. Actually, you know what? I hate the way that looks. I'm gonna have to keep him. All right, now I'm doing the dupes this time, but I actually added a um, a giant block over top of it. So now, if everything goes according to plan... Wait, did I just dupe it inside of each other? I did. I'm an idiot. If everything goes according to plan... Jeez, man, everything is going wrong. <laughs> I can now actually rotate things without, like, the location of things, like, being, like, really messed up and stuff. So a little something like so. I'm gonna hide these blocks real quick. Oh, dude, this is gonna be so sick. We're gonna have to give them both a bit of rotation. Yeah dude. Oh, this is gonna be so sick. All right, now we're gonna have to connect these things with an actual body, and of course, it's also gonna need a head. So uh, let's start working on those things, because honestly, that's gonna be by far the most difficult part, because I can't just use these things that I've previously built. All right, those proportions look a little better. All right, let's start by adding in just a regular block, just so we can kind of get an idea for the dimensions here. Oh, dude, that right there would actually be insane, though. Oh... <gasps> Yeah, of course, the head is just gonna have to be a big block on top. Yeah, a little something like so, dude. Oh my god. This is gonna be my favorite mech I've ever made. <laughs> oh, so, I hate to say it, but I think I know exactly what needs to be done. So, we're gonna take this one piece right here, just for reference. And we're gonna take one of these trees and clone this out as well. And yeah, let's, let, let's, let's clean this whole thing up a little bit. This is gonna be the torso, but we're gonna have to do some really funky tricks. So, one thing that I really wanna keep is the, you know, the kind of like bumpy, like, you know, circle effect that you got right there. I really wanna keep that, but it's a hard thing to build with because first off, it's a circle. And second off, it's extremely laggy. And there's like a thousand of them. So, yeah, doing this is gonna be a bit of a challenge. All right, so we wanna find one of these circles that's very separated from the rest. And I think this one is gonna have to be the one. And the way we're gonna separate it is actually by scaling up whatever, everything that's part of the circle. Oh, this is totally gonna work out. Oh my God, we picked the perfect thing. All right, so we got one entire one of those things uh, separated. So we're gonna just go around here and delete everything else. All right, boom, one stick left. All right, there it is. We have one stick right now and uh, we're gonna have to need obviously a lot of sticks. But first and foremost, we need to figure out the exact height because yeah, right now, I mean, this thing is way shorter than that thing. Yeah, that's perfect. Perfect. All right, perfect. There's my tube. All right, then next up, we're gonna go around and cloning this in kind of like a circular shape, but it doesn't have to be exact. Oh, uh, dude, this is gonna be so sick. Okay, this is gonna take a while though, so... Oh, man, give me a minute. <laughs> dude, this is such a weird building technique, man. I have never really done anything like this, uh, and I can see why, because this is strange, man. I mean, it's gonna look really cool though when it's done. All right, half is done. Now we get to do the easy part. I right, just take the whole thing and clone it. <laughs> and boop, rotate around. And if everything goes according to the plan, it doesn't look terrible. Okay, okay, wait, wait, wait. I mean, I don't know if I would call it terrible. Actually, it's pretty all right. Actually, I might even go as far as to say it's pretty good. I tried to kind of keep the shape like a bit weird, uh, and I think it is. <laughs> it's good, I like it. All right, I'm gonna spread everything out just a little bit because yeah, right now everything is a bit close together. Dude, that's that is starting to look so sick. <laughs> okay, it, it needs some detail, okay? It needs some detail. Here, I'm gonna take some of these and start throwing them on. All right, so a little while later, I think it should be all done now. So rather than it just being one big, boring, bland mess of nothing, he's got some stuff. And honestly, I actually think this adds a lot to make it not look super boring. So yeah, that is perfect. <laughs> oh my God, dude, this is turning out so cool. 
All right, now for the head, I have a bit of an idea. So let me grab this right here. This is just one of the bushes from one of these trees. And yeah, I think that actually looks like pretty cool. Now, how am I gonna turn just a bush into a head? And I have a bit of an idea. And it pretty much involves taking this one bush and kind of making the most of it. Because in theory, we should be able to just kind of use the same. I ran out of bush blocks! No! How many do I have? 48 le- Oh my god. We can buy them. Okay, let's just buy 50 of them. I don't even know. That's just gonna be enough for one more dupe, though. That's not even. <sighs> okay, we might have to make this thing hollow, which would make this take a lot more freaking time. Okay, right, we can delete those. We can delete those, actually. That'll free up some blocks. Okay, we only have a thousand left. There's no chance. Okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to redo this whole thing. I have an idea, but yeah, what we're gonna have to do is actually start with like an empty hollow cube. And actually, this is kind of nice because it also gives us, you know, a place to actually build like the inside of the robot. So it's kind of cool. And then yeah, we're gonna just decorate the outside. All right, there you go. That's the head to start and now we're gonna add a bunch of stuff to it Wait, what if the hair is actually <laughs> wait you know what that might actually be kind of funny what if that is actually the hair <laughs> All right, that right there is actually looking pretty cool. It's looking kind of like a bush and it looks pretty decent, okay? I, 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 got, I can only do what I can with, you know, a limited amount of blocks. But I think on that note, it's about time that we assemble all the different parts. <laughs> now, there's many different ways of actually turning this into a proper mech, but honestly, I feel like building the old method, okay? A classic firework glitch uh, mech is something I haven't seen in a long time. So you know what? I'm bringing it back. Okay, so let me get out of here. And whoop, there you go. All right, so we're gonna have to connect all of the different pieces together. So this right here is the torso and the head rotates on the torso. So we're gonna have to add a, you might think a wheel. Actually, we're not gonna add a wheel. We're actually gonna be adding a servo. And then we're gonna take the head and we're gonna attach that just like that, perfect. Oh, right, you know what? There's only one way to test this. Let's see if these two parts are even connected. I use the classic firework. Yeah, this is gonna be very laggy, but it's okay. Oh my God, wait, it's working. Okay, wait, it's kind of just spinning though. Servo torque, race that a little bit. So yeah, now if we start looking in one direction, the body is kind of like right after the head, you know? So we can actually spin the head, but if we like actually start moving around, yeah, as you guys can see, the, the, the torso is like just behind you. This is amazing. Perfect. All right, now we're gonna need body parts. So let's add those in next. Now, because all of these different parts are like very awkward shapes, I'm kind of thinking about this and I'm like, it's turning out to be a little bit harder than I initially planned. Oh God, okay, that is uh, not looking too hot. Oops. <laughs> all right, let's try one more time. <laughs> Oh, actually works. All right. And that looks freaking good. Oh, dude, that looks really good. <laughs> All right, then. I think with that, we have everything done. Just got to hide the uh, the ugly bits and bobs. All right, then. There it is. That is the entire thing done. Now, currently, it might not look exactly the way you might expect. But, dude, look at this. Let me actually get inside. We are now inside of the mech. And all we're going to have to do is simply flick a lever. And this entire thing should freaking come to life. All right, then, baby. Here we go. Firework time. Boom. Okay, we're stuck. Okay, wait, we, we gotta unlink the firework. That would ruin the whole thing. Select all. Unanchor. And everything will stay, oh my god, upright. And we flick the lever. And all of the different body parts get pulled together. Oh my god. Dude, we actually have a mech. <laughs> all right, let's add an animation. Oh my god, baby. <laughs> Dude, we got a freaking tree mech. Let's go! All right, guys, don't mind me just hanging out. <laughs> All right, come on, let me stand up. Thank you very much. <laughs> No, I don't know why my arms got stuck in this pose, but I mean, it's something. Now, I'm going to turn PvP on because I'm definitely equipped to fight. Uh, I, I, I might actually have to place a couple cannons. <laughs> but you know what? One of these should actually do. That is my mouth, everyone. Oh my God, dude. We can actually freaking... Wait, I was about to say we can aim this thing. We cannot aim this thing. It fell off immediately. There you go, guys. That's our new mouth. <laughs> Woo! We can aim it now. Let's go. There he is. Come on. <laughs> Oh, God, dude. Okay, I think I might just get messed up in a minute. What did he just load? Okay, I, I, I just broke my knees. Ugh, I just broke my knees. Uh, please just fix my knees. That's all I want. Ugh. Okay, that's the split. At least my legs aren't all broken this time. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God, he's ramming into me. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Uh, I jump over, you noob. Yeah, bro, look at us flinging, baby. Woo! Look at my eye dance. Let's go. Wait, what if they just launched a single fire potion? <laughs> Wait, I think he's gonna try it. <laughs> All right, a single fire potion. Oh God, okay, wait, that only broke one piece. Oh God! Okay, he's burning the most painful part. Oh God. <laughs> ah! 
Oh, wait. Oh, God. He's breaking pit. Er, he's breaking things. Oh, this is bad. This is crazy. <laughs> They're real. Ah! Okay, we're getting exploded right now. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Wait, is that the Mandalorian? <laughs> what is that? Not the Mandalorian. What is it? The DeLorean. The DeLorean. Yes, yes, yes. Bro, what? <laughs> <laughs> oh! Oh, God! Explosions. Don't mind me just standing here, boys. I really wish these arms would stop uh, being broken. <laughs> oh, God. Wait. Uh, TNT incoming! Dude, what are they launching at me? Ah! Okay, there goes my sternum. <laughs> Okay, we're still standing though. Oh my god, dude, we're hitting. We're, you're literally being hit with everything right now. Oh jeez, my entire torso is gone. Uh oh, he's coming for me. Yes, I am, baby. Come here, boy. Oh god, right in the head. Oh, this is bad. <laughs> wait, what are they launching at me? Oh god, wait. Oh my god, there are so many. Ah! Oh my god. How did they fly through me? Oh my goodness. Oh, there is more coming. There is more coming. Oh god, I don't think I can get out of the way. Oh god, my legs. Oh my legs. Oh. Ooh. Ah! Oh no! Okay, we just uh we just got crumbled into pieces, but my head still works! I will crush this kid. <laughs> I will crush you! Yeah, I, I will admit defeat. <laughs> oh god! Okay, wait. Is that gonna hit me? I have a feeling that's gonna Oh yep, that's hitting me. 